Welcome back one and all to Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone where we failed major last time. So I uh, remember this much. Oh god, what did I just do? Yeah, so it's already a bad sign, I think. It's telling me, do not play this game. Because you're only going to lose. Almost went straight for it again. It's already activated, so I don't know what I'm doing that for. Yes, I remember doing all this last time, and I can't remember what it was I failed at. Maybe I missed a jump or something. Oh, yeah, 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 I need to get round to that, fair enough. It always looks like you're going to miss the jump, and I wouldn't even trust myself to make it any time. Yeah, I know what I did wrong last time. Haha. <laughs> Alright, well, we got to get back around to that then. So. That's locked off. That's locked off. Got to walk around. E Flipendo with that switch. If I can target it. That's exactly what I didn't want. Come on then, take me up. I know you can do it. I've seen you. That might help. Is that going to take me up even higher? No, 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 that just takes me back fucking down. How many times can you cast a pendo on something before it actually works? Too many. Finally! You know, it was making me think like it wasn't gonna ever happen. You see a save game book, so. Looks like we're winning. Finally. Uh, great, I can see more for Pendo stuff. Oh, the, don't tell me that's the bloody Baron again. Stop it. I'm going to die in a minute. There better be a chocolate frog in here. Well, that leaves me dangerously low on health. To the point where I shouldn't even be moving right now. What's going on over here? Are we locked in? Bugger. Well, 
well. That's no good, is it? Oh my god, that's why. Why do ghosts even use gates? And why do you feel pain when you walk into them? Unanswerable Potter logic. Fuges for that. Still leaving you dangerously low on health, don't get me wrong, but a little bit better off now. Curious if I could get it from here. Should have known. Off we go in the floating cloud of light. Otherwise known as Lumos. seem dangerous. I need to remember to stop attempting stupid shit like this. Uh. Alright, another checkpoint, that's good. Oh yeah. Now I've got to wait for him again. And uh, whichever one you want to do today. Well, we're going through these wizard cards. Let's just have a stop and check at this. Um, page one, page two, page three, page four, page five, page six, and page seven. So we're not far off collecting them all, to be totally honest. Don't think it's quite going to happen in this series, but... At some point in my life, it may well be. I hear the sort of danger music in the background. Probably because there's a ghost lurking about, but... So I need to be ready to walk back through there when he comes back. Oh, I think it waits for you. Alright, wrong way, first time. Ditty. And we're back again. What's he gonna do this time? Late again, you lazy boy. A further three points from Gryffindor should teach you a lesson. You I see you've busted. collected a few challenge stars, but I'm afraid they have no value in my classroom. I've ended the lesson without you, Potter. The other students are off to the Halloween feast. Join them if you must. What a prick. Harry! A huge troll is on the rampage! It's cornered Hermione in the girls' bathroom! She needs our help! We must try to rescue her straight away! Ah, oh God, here we go.
Oh yeah, escape the troll. I remember this. For a minute I was thinking I can't remember what it was like to fight it. What's that smell? Turns out you don't have to fight it. This way, Harry. Not this shit again. God, here we go. Oh no, the controls are all inverted for Reminds me of the old style Crash Bandicoot stuff. So. I mean, if you watch one of the older parts on Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex, you'll see exactly what I mean. Luckily, it's a lot of fun to play these sort of missions. Until that happens. And then you have to start again. I fucking knew it happened. Harry, what's that smell? Is it the troll? I don't know. This way, Harry. This way, Harry? He says all calm. Once again, hopefully, we'll have a little bit more luck this time. Come on, come get me. Check save, check save. What am I talking about? Checkpoint, save book, whatever you want to call it. The troll is enormous. Mate, you've just been running from it. think you can lose on this bit. Probably about to be through from the amount of times it's hitting. So he throws it that way. I'm 
not too good at this, to be quite honest. now because it'll probably be easier. To Harry McGonagall. Return to the Gryffindor Fucking watch his face as well and Quirrell, what, what have you? And, you know. That someone had released the troll to distract everyone so that they could get into the Forbidden Corridor. But there wasn't much time to think about who was behind this, especially since Harry was busy preparing for the second Quidditch match against Ravenclaw. Welcome to Quidditch! Alright, oh, Quidditch match, yeah, of course. Lee Jordan! It's Gryffindor versus Ravenclaw! Let's play Quidditch! Let's hope this one goes a little bit better than the last time. Is that the snitch? Here comes the Ravenclaw Seeker! annoying with this bit because you just get so close and then you just lose track of it. Amazing 
Come on. Look at Potter go. Look at those shakers go. Maybe the trick is not to accelerate too much. Obviously enough that you catch up with them, but then don't overdo it. And that's what I need to get out of the habit of. That was actually very close. Finally got there. Sorry, there wasn't very much commentary, so I think that's probably a good thing. Filch and his cat, Mrs. Norris. Here we go. Um, I always do this, just sort of very, very laggy, slow movements, just to make sure that he doesn't spot you straight away. And you can't jump up there straight away. So where's he now? He's gone around the back of that bookcase, hasn't he? Oh, yes, he has. Uh, so we can get up here. He's looking straight at me. You get some uh, odd glitches on this. Um, sorry, let me say that again. You get some odd glitches on this area of the game. Which I might try and discover again, but I'll try and keep it as legit as possible. So there's a save game book, that's always good. And as you'll find at, at the end of each um, part of this area, Filch will open up a bookcase after you've left the door, almost as if he knows that you've gone into a different room, and he will go and have a wander around go through secret entrances end up in the next room where you are like that and I can't find it but as soon as he sees or hears a door open he runs towards the door without thinking you know oh 
he must have flipped that switch at the other end of the room. He's not that clever. I better step back a bit. Otherwise, I won't be that clever. Hopefully you won't find out what happens if he catches me. If you don't already know that is. I mean, it's obvious what's going to happen, but... You know exactly what I mean. I like the funny comments he comes out with as well, like the noises he makes. Why can I not make that jump? Is it because I need to go that side first? I'd imagine that's exactly what it is. Now I'm going to jump straight over him. Ooh, that was close. So yeah, that, that's basically it. If he like, if he hears your footsteps coming towards him, or if he sort of senses that you're nearby, he will start running after you, and you've got a bit of time to escape. Always hold back a bit once you've opened a door or flipped a switch or something, because you will go running towards it every time, and it's a bit nasty if it catches you. Now, how can I get up there? I wonder. Being quite careful around here. I think it's pretty clear what you need to do. So we'll make our way over. Try our very best not to get caught. And I think we're pretty safe for now. Just so happened that time he's right next to it. I had enough time to jump down and beat him to it that time. But I didn't quite act on it fast enough. And that's a little bit of a, a glitch as well, but sometimes you don't get caught if you land on his head. Um, so now we're back to here. So unfortunately, we've got to do this bit again. I'm just going to try and blitz through it as quickly as I can. Check that out to find absolutely nothing. And as soon as he wanders off, we'll give him a chance this time. And then jump straight over him. I'm so close. But I know he can't come in here, so that's why I'm taking my risks. Now, how can I get up there? And I can see his light around the back, so I should be fine to go this way. Um, bit more up here. Hope to God that I make this jump. 
Back over here again. Over here this way, up there. And we'll try our best not to fail this time. As if I just did that. Right, well that's it for now folks. Um, because I can't be bothered to carry that on just yet. So, thanks for watching once again. Um, please leave a like, a comment, a subscribe. Even share the video with your friends if you like. It all helps and it's all beneficial. Uh, to all of us because it shows that you're interested it gives me support on my videos um, and that way I'll be more inclined to do more videos because I know yeah like I say there's more there's interest in it and you want it to continue so thanks again and I'll see you next time